Hey guys, it's Reefaholic. I just wanted to give a little update video on the CP treatment. It's February the 7th. <clears throat> We're about a week in. And I have noticed that this fish is acting weird. He's sitting on the bottom. He's not wanting to eat. So it does seem like he is sensitive to the medication. However, he is faded. Um, and the other fish look really good. So I'm kind of wondering, is he coming down with velvet or is he having a reaction to the high 80 milligram dose that I dosed? And it was actually probably more like 90 because I did a heaping um, teaspoon or whatever the dose was. So another thing I want to note, I did dose this tank twice in a week, um, but it's not how you're thinking because I did 100% water change. And if you do 100% water change, you want to redose the medication the full amount. So being that I did dose it twice, you can see the other fish are tolerating it well. But if he is, um, if he does have sensitivity to the medication, and I hit him with two full doses uh, in a week, even though I changed the water 100%, maybe he had a reaction to that, or maybe it was because it was the max dose, and actually a little bit more than that, probably about 90 milligrams to 10 gallons is what I did. So uh, it's hard to say, but if you look at the bottom of this fish, he's very faded. He's getting skinny. Um, and some fish, whenever they have velvet, that's what they do. They just, they will sit on the bottom of the tank or they will sit in a PVC pipe and just die. So I really don't know it, it could be sensitivity, it could be he's coming down with velvet. I will say it is ironic that none of the other fish are showing any sensitivity, it's only him. So we know that it's been said that blue tangs are sensitive to this medication and being that I did dose the highest dose, I would almost think that that's what it is until you look and see how faded he is. So what I did, I went ahead and removed him. Uh, I put him in this tank and I started Coopermine because if he is coming down with velvet, I want to I wanna nip it in the butt quick, okay? So I hate to do that, especially when he's not eating because it's almost like a death sentence. You know when you start dosing copper, a lot of fish, especially if they're already doing bad, they're not going to want to eat. So I'm just like, man, am I really doing this? But if it is velvet, I want to try to get it before it gets him. So either way, it's kind of a last resort. But I will note, in this next little clip that you're gonna see, when I woke up, he was actually not like he is now. So here he is. And I was very surprised when I woke up. So one, he's either tolerating this medication better, or two, it's actually killing off the velvet. So being that the other fish aren't breaking out i just i really don't know you know i almost want to say it's the medication but then when i look and see how faded he is i'm just sitting here thinking man is it is it the medication or is he starting to break out with velvet so because that's what they do sometimes they'll get really faded like that at first and then they then they'll have the the white powdered sugar look so i really don't know uh, and then if you look right here, this was just a while ago. Uh, if you look at his tail, his tail's starting to get discolored with like some like a reddish uh, maroon looking color. And it's exactly where he was getting faded at. So I don't know. I mean, it could be some, maybe a bacterial infection. I really don't know. So here's the update. I hope you guys like it. I'll update again soon.